Welcome to the GSM Tidy channel. Today I brought you a new video about the new version of the Hafec Tool version 2. First, we'll start with the way to download the tool. As you can see, we will open the browser, then we will go to the following link. Opening the link, we will search for the word Hafet GSM Tool. We download the tool. We wait 10 seconds, and then after the end of the download of the tool, we're going to install them. In the first version, the tool was divided into two interfaces. The second version, the tool was integrated into one interface with the integration of the properties present in the two interfaces. As you notice, the tools are compressed and must be installed from inside the compressed file because it is encrypted and protected in a great way. An installation from inside the compressed file will facilitate the process. We will install the settings as you notice on the interface in a very normal way. And as a note, the first version must be scanned from the computer and install the new version because the order of files has been changed inside the tool. Solving all problems with the first version will wait a bit until the installation is completed. As you can see, this is the interface of the tool. This version has been modified and a set of features have been added. And in the next video, we will try the tool on the Samsung phone and remove the FRP on it. As for today's video, we will explain how to activate the tool and subscribe to it. And all this will be free. As a note, the subscription to this tool is by ID for each computer, and the registration of hands is free of charge. Once you click on the OK button, the official website of the tool and its database opens with us. As you can see, there is a registration option. After successfully completing the registration through this subscription, you can register the tool. We open the tool and then click on the tool's serial number. Then we paste the serial on the site. completing the registration process of the serial. We close the device and then open it again. Note that the tool has been activated well and is now working. 
In the rest of the videos, we will explain how the tool works in practice. Thank you for watching the video. Any question I will answer in the comments.